What's up guys, Noctilus here. If you're like me and are about to start playing Elden Ring, you might be wondering what character is best for me to start Elden Ring with? So here's the quick and dirty for you. If you want to play a pure mage, pick Astrologer. If you want to play a melee tank with big damage, pick Vagabond. If you want to play a high melee damage character with lots of stamina for dodging, pick Hero. And if you want to play an all-round warrior with health and stamina, pick Warrior. If you want to play a dex-based melee ranged hybrid, pick Samurai. And if you want to play a thief, assassin, rogue type character or a character that has bleeds, pick Bandit. If you want to play a spellblade, magic sword user hybrid, pick Prisoner. If you want to play with fire, pick Prophet. If you want to play an all-around spellcaster with a bit of melee, pick Confessor. If you just want to have the hardest time possible, then pick Wretch. In addition to this, I'm going to suggest that you like, subscribe, hit the notification bell down below, and check out my stream on Elden Ring on Twitch in the link down below as well. And then take a look at the weapons page on the Fextra Life Elden Ring wiki page and see what weapons you want to use later in the game. Then pick your class according to the attributes that are going to scale for that weapon. It's also just nice to see what cool looking weapons there are for you to find in the game because who doesn't like to look good when they're dying 700 plus times to the same boss, which definitely didn't happen to me. Uh, so if we jump into the Fextra Life Elden Ring weapons wiki page and scroll down, you'll see all the weapon types listed here. Check out any weapon type that looks interesting to you and see if it appeals to you. I'm going to check out the Colossal Swords here because I like huge two-hander swords and you can see most of them actually scale with strength and dexterity. So I would pick a class that matches those stats when I start out so I have a more optimized build later on in the game. There may be some specific weapons that scale with stats that most of the other weapons in that weapon type don't. For example, here you can see that Malekith's Black Blade scales with Faith in addition to Strength and Dexterity. The letter beneath the number denotes the grade of the scaling or how well that weapon scales with that stat. From best to worst, the grades go S, A, B, C, D, then E. So S means it scales really well, E means it doesn't scale well, but you still get benefit from it. You can increase the grade of the scaling by upgrading your weapon throughout the game. For reference, here's a quick summary of the stats in which each class starts out strongly in. The Vagabond has high strength and dexterity with the highest starting health of any of the classes, so this is good for beginners wanting the classic strength weapon, high health, chad build. Warrior is a high dexterity with a medium amount of strength and intelligence, as well as medium levels of health, mana, and stamina. The Confessor is medium levels of everything, but is slightly higher in faith, so this might be good for an all-around build. Hero has high strength with a good amount of balanced health and stamina. Bandit has high arcane and dexterity with a medium amount of balanced health and stamina. The Astrologer is a high intelligence and dexterity class with high mana but low health and stamina. The Prophet has high faith with lots of mana but low stamina. And the Samurai has high dexterity with high stamina and a good amount of health and mana as well. The Prisoner has high dexterity and intelligence and medium levels of health, mana, and stamina. The Wretch starts with the same levels of everything, and this class starts without any armor and starts at level 1, whereas the other other classes start at a higher level and with armor. Of course, these are only the starting points, and the beauty of this game is that you can make whatever build you want by allocating the stats accordingly and trying out different combinations, so you're encouraged to explore. So what classes are you going to start playing Elden Ring with, or what classes have you already started playing Elden Ring with? Let me know in the comments down below. I'm actually going to be starting with the Wretch, um, and we'll be streaming the playthrough starting this Saturday live on Twitch. We're going to be playing with the Wretch. It'll be a blind first playthrough, no using guys, no using summons, just me dying in as many painful ways as possible. And I'm sure the chat will be misleading me plenty as well while we play, so I'll see you guys there.